A week is back after a three-year hiatus. Uh, in three days, you'll have close to three dozen options for food at a discounted price. Sounds yummy. Arbella Caracta is on your side with what you need to know to take advantage of good deals during the 10 tastiest days of the year. It wasn't long ago the owner of Herb Saint had to get creative to draw in business during the pandemic. It was a prolonged, you know, year and a half, almost two years of really difficult um, sales and just trying to get people comfortable with coming back out. In 2021, when Visit Omaha put out feelers to see if places were ready to bring back restaurant week. We got a lot of no's, a few undecided, a couple yeses, so we thought we've got to wait. While some restaurants this year said they weren't ready to participate due to staffing constraints, 34 restaurants across the metro are offering three-course, price-fixed menus, ranging from $30 to $50. Justin Halbert's answer to the call this year? Enthusiastically, yes. The owners of Herb Saint and Canara, a few miles away in Omaha, a world apart in cuisine, No, running a business during a busy event like this takes preparation. I'm going to prepare like an extra prep and more staffing and we do have a reservation system so that will help too so we can get an idea how many people gonna be here. While reservations are not required to participate, they're recommended to secure a spot. For most of the year, Visit Omaha's focus is on tourists, but for this event, all eyes are on the locals, the local restaurants, the local farmers, and the local foodies. The restaurants are ready and the community is probably ready too. This is my passion. I've been doing this for over 20 years and I'm so glad that I'm here in Omaha and I can bring an experience from Kerala where I'm from. I know I'm excited for restaurant week, reservations made, and I'm already planning to wear some stretchy pants. On your side in Omaha, Bella Karakta, 6 News. Girl, I'm right there with you. We'll make reservations together. Now, meantime, the event is also giving back. 5% of proceeds from the Restaurant Week menus go to the Food Bank for the Heartland. And get this, in 2019, those proceeds added up to $10,000 for the nonprofit.